Hi, I'm Dean Yesberg and welcome to our first report from our new premises at 62 Maryvale Street, South Brisbane. We moved in three weeks ago. It's been an incredible three weeks of trying to prepare and get the, the building ready. Uh, it's taken about three or four months to, to build, but it's been worth the effort. It's a fantastic location for our clients and for our properties. I'm sitting right now in our auction room. Our first auction is on the 28th of April. Saturday, 10 o'clock, we're putting 18 properties up for auction and the room looks fantastic. The marketplace, what's going on? It's a question that as a real estate agent, we're constantly asked. There's no doubt, and I'm not gonna sugarcoat it, the market right now is a tough one. A lot of people have asked me in, in my 22 years, Dean, is this the toughest market you've seen? My answer to that is no, it's not. Uh, whilst it is tough, there was a period during the early to mid 90s where certainly I believe the marketplace then was a lot tougher. We had interest rates at 18%, unemployment at 12%, and in the words of our Prime Minister at that stage, Mr Keating, we had a recession that we had to have. Also what we saw then was a drastic drop in the numbers of sales and the numbers of properties on the market. Now we are starting to see that in the current market. According to RP data, over the last 12 months, the Brisbane real estate market values wise has dropped by 6.8%. In the same report that came through, the numbers of sales that have actually taken place in that last 12 months has dropped by 25%. So we are seeing a definite decrease in the numbers of properties being sold. So the sales levels have almost dropped back to the same levels as that early to mid 90s period. What are the reasons for this? Well, certainly it's not the number of buyers in the marketplace. We're still getting great numbers of buyers and inquiries of both the internet and the courier mail and through our databasing. And we're also getting good numbers of buyers through our open houses. The real reason right now is not the lack of buyers. It's the lack of confidence that buyers have in the current marketplace. Most buyers believe that the market is still going to go down. Now, I disagree with this. I think we're pretty much at the bottom of our marketplace. And this is the time for buyers to actually buy property, certainly over the next six months. It's a great opportunity to buy. There's an old saying, you won't know where the bottom of the marketplace is until you've gone past it. So I really urge buyers right now not to be lambs and follow the herd. Now is the time to jump into the marketplace. There's good signs in the marketplace. Interest rates are very low traditionally. Also our unemployment rate at just a little bit over 5% is still very, very low. And that shows the difference in the marketplace now compared to what it was back in that 90s. And that's why I feel that this marketplace isn't as tough as that period. So what we're finding is we're finding good numbers of buyers coming through our open houses in regards to properties that are well marketed. At a recent auction that we had at the Greek Club, we had 14 auctions. We sold 10 of those properties under the hammer. It was a great event. We had probably 150 to 200 people come along to watch the auctions. The more telling stat was that we had 76 registered bidders on the day. So we had 76 buyers there wanting to buy a property and that contributed to the great success of that night for our owners. So properties that are well marketed, positioned properly, going through a process, are still selling in the current marketplace. At the recent Ray White Awards held in March, our offices, both the CBD office and the South Brisbane office, and particularly the individuals within our office, picked up numerous awards. It was a great night for the officers, uh, both in the top 20 of Ray White. More importantly, Colin Walsh from our CBD office was number three in the state for numbers of sales and also number six in the state for dollar turnover. A wonderful effort from Colin to be in the top 10 of Ray White throughout Queensland. Also, Cassandra Iverson won our Administrator of the Year award throughout the whole group. Our Property Management Division won awards and the office was recognised for our auction successes. It was a great night. So we've got some great, exciting upcoming events. One I've already mentioned is our first auctions in our auction, new auction rooms at the Property Centre at Maryvale Street on Saturday the 28th of April. 18 auctions, it's going to be a great event. Uh, we've already sold three of those properties prior to, so we're putting up 15. It should be a great event. Other things that are happening, we're having our first careers night on the 3rd of May, which will be a very good event. We've already advertised for that. We've got a number of people coming along, so if you want to get into real estate, give us a call, and we'll have those careers nights probably every month. Our next auctions after that, are going to be a Thursday night, the 17th of May, and again, you know, a great time. The reason why we're pushing the auctions is in this marketplace, it's just a great time to be marketing property with a process, with a date. And that date is really forcing buyers off the fence. 
and right now they are sitting on the fence. So we need to give them a bit of a push, get them off the fence and into buying property because it's a great time to be buying. It's for their best interest that they buy property right now in this current marketplace. Don't wait, move now and we'll see you on the 28th of April here, putting your hand up, buying great property in the inner city around Brisbane. So thanks for your time, hope you enjoyed the video. We'll see you next time from Dean Yesberg from our new property centre. We'll check you next time.